think you have any idea how fast I really am. And Gara Kante wins the ball. <laughs> What a tackle. Just picked up the pitch. Now Bernardo Silva. What a tackle. Come on, Come on, it's Come on, it's oh, yeah. He's so nice, he's so friendly, always smiling. Like I never saw him angry. Never seen him angry? No. Ever? No. Good evening. Are you kidding me? This man is. I love it! Fucking love it! I swear you'll never see anything like this ever again! God damn! Everyone loves N'Golo Kante. Are you struggling to win on FIFA because your team is really bad? Shocking, dreadful, not quality. Do you need coins for a cheeky new team? I need. You can head over to u7buy.com for cheap, fast, and reliable coins. And if you use code McShell, you'll get a 5% discount. Okay then, boys and girls. Today, we're going to be jumping into an N'Golo Kante flashback review. Now, this is an interesting one, lads, because this card is, like, it's overpriced. Like, let's not pretend this card is, is not overpriced. This card is expensive as hell. It should not be that expensive, in my opinion. I'm pretty sure this is based off of his FIFA 17 card, if I'm not mistaken. And that card was, like, 30, 40k back then. And that was when the market was too expensive, you know. And now the market is absolutely dead. This card should not be 300, for, like, 1,000 coins. That is ridiculous. So, obviously, I did not do this card on the RTG lads. I've done it on the pay to win account. Okay, this is what the pay to win account was built for is to do SBCs that I want to do, but there's no way in hell I would do them on the RTG. And also, let's just a quick side note. I was not expecting this SBC to come out, obviously. Like, I, I already had a video planned for today. So the video that was meant to be today is now going to be pushed to Sunday. I'm not going to spoil what it is, but I'm just basically saying this because Rule Breakers comes out on Friday and I'm not going to be able to get any content for Rule Breakers until next week. Are you fucking crazy? Huh? So just be patient with the Rule Breakers stuff lads if we get a rule breakers king kubo with 99 pace i'm not gonna be able to review it until like tuesday so yeah lads, this is the team that we're rocking out with okay i haven't shown you my main team on the pay to win account for a really long time we've obviously still got a boy veron we've got nedved of course we have got this inform ganabri who's uh really really good i really like this card over here we've got lewandowski lads i was actually using earl and harland but i couldn't fit him into the team anymore because we've got kante we've got a pretty cheeky defense here in cooler Bali and inform romero we did get this red chillwell who i don't know if he's gonna be good because he's not the quickest but i felt like we might as well try him. And then of course, that's we have N'Golo Kante, who's got a pretty good card, lads. I'm not going to pretend it's not a good card. It's a very good card. Is it worth 300k, though? I just think that's just way too much money. So yeah, starting off, boys, you've got high, high work rates, which is obviously really, really nice, especially if you're using this card as a box-to-box. -box. It's got two-star skill moves, but I mean, if you're using Kante for skill moves, like, you're, you're a crackhead. You've got three-star weak foot, which, you know, I would have liked four-star, but it makes sense. And the best part about this card by far, lads, is the fact that he's got a nice little pace upgrade, okay? 86 acceleration, 79 sprint speed, very, very nice indeed. Shooting stats are pretty bad. Like they're definitely not, you know, they're definitely not great. And again, if you're gonna use this card as a box to box, you're probably wanting to like boost it a little bit. I've gone with the gladiator here, lads, because you get a plus 15 finishing, so it goes up to let's just do the maths now. It goes up to 80, which is actually pretty good. Dribbling stats here, really, really nice, lads. Obviously, not the craziest in-game dribbling, but he's got incredible reactions there. Agility is insane. You got good balance. The defending is absolutely outrageous, lads, especially when you look at those interceptions. That is filthy. Gives me a boner. I like it. And as for physical, obviously not the craziest strength. But this is a big one, okay? 98 stamina. That is that's amazing. Overall, it's a really good card. It's just a lot of money for what you're getting. Like if I compare this card to like player of the month for Fana that came out a few days ago, for Fana is half the price of this card, and alright, he's nowhere near as linkable, but he's way better in almost every stat. I just don't think this card is worth 300 k This should be like at most 200 k I feel like. So yeah, boys, we jump to a bit of game bag. Okay? Hopefully, Kante is just an absolute god, okay? Hopefully he is worth that money because that would be amazing. So yeah, let's jump into game. Number one. Right, big boy Kante. Okay, this card. He he feels quick. He's got some pace. Nice from Kante. So just a couple of little one twos. Very cheeky. Should I go for a long shot? Oh! Oh! And go low Kante. That is not a bad effort considering you've got like really shit long shots. Yeah, good play here, lads. Big boy Kante. He slots it. It's got to be. It's got to be. We can't miss from there, lads. Great little play there. Kante with a little free pass. Love to see that. That's good. Back two. Oh, that is phenomenal. Chip the goalie. Oh, 
Oh, through that, through that. Oh, nice. What a pass. And again, Veron. Beautiful play. Nefed. On to the left foot. He's got the fire stole. Honestly, Kante feels crazy on the ball. He feels so good on the ball. That is incredible from Kante. Honestly, lads, I, I, I didn't want to say this card might be worth it, but he, he certainly is tickling the pickle. Good boy, Kante. Oh, nice. Back two. Veron Jr. Chip the goalie. Veron Jr. That is sauce. What a beautiful human being. I'm going to have a little run with him, lads, because he is absolutely broken. When it comes, look, I mean, look at him. Look at the way he... Because of that five for six, he just fucking glides. I'm abusing this poor lad. Kante. He is... He, that is... I mean, that's lucky as fuck. But it, that all stems from Kante's just incredible footwork, man. I'm serious. This card's dribbling is outrageous. Nice. One more. Back two. Oh, that's phenomenal. That is phenomenal. Sweat that. Oh, lads, the play. The absolute source of the play. 5-0. We like, we're just like actually playing good today. Stop! <laughs> He's already dead. No. No, no, lads. What, what, why, are you, why are we going to give up the four-wheel clean sheet dance that easy? Cooley, how are you going to get Lumbeck there? That's terrible. How much, oh, Kante winning the header though, 5 for 6. All right, we got the win, boys. We got the 4 goal dance. Would have liked the clean sheet dance, but uh, do you know what? I'll take it. We got a cheeky win there, so I can't complain. Yeah, lads, that was an absolutely incredible performance from Kante. I've got not one, like, one bad word to say about this card. He was outrageously good. I mean, look at that heat map. He's everywhere, man. Look at that shit. His dribbling, lads, I kid you not. With that pace as well, obviously the pace upgrade is definitely something to consider. He's, he, feel, he feels so good on the ball, lads. If you need a box to box, like, he is, like, it doesn't come much better. So, yeah, lads, we're jumping to another game. Hopefully, Kante would just absolutely destroy another team and just run havoc. That'd be great. So, yeah, lads, we're jumping to game number two. <laughs> No, no, come on EA, don't fucking do me like this like three minutes in, don't fucking do that shit. Oh, what the hell, Mendy saved the fuck out of me there, this guy's all over me, it's only like seven minutes in. We're playing Ned Fed, come on Neddy, come on Neddy, come on Neddy, I went too hard, I went, I just should have shot like an old human. Oh, I'm going live. Two here with Veron. That's the one. That's the one. And again and again. Veron! Oh! oh! Bollocks. Watch that run. No, I didn't watch the run. I literally said it and then just proceeded not to watch it. What's wrong with me? Do you think I'm dumb? Yes. Kante. Come on, Kante. Push him off the ball. There you go. There you go. Good defender. Oh, that's a shocking pass, though, Kante. Come on. Over the top. Get it though, is he? Oh, he is when he gives it away. Yes, Canabry. Great finish. Right, we're right back in it, lads. Come on, we push on now. Oh, fuck it. I literally, like, two seconds ago got back in the game. One more to Veron. Good. And again. That's worked, but it's not where I wanted it. But, all right. Come on. Lewin. Oh, the... Lewin. Fucking use of sack of shit. Get out. It is what it is, lads. Didn't get the win there. Didn't play the best. I'm not going to lie. Definitely could have played better. Certainly had some chances, but did not take them, unfortunately. It is what it is, lads. It is what it is. So, yeah, lads. Definitely not as good as a performance as the last game from Kante. I and mean, if you look at the heat map, obviously, he's, he's a lot more pushed back than he was in the last game. Not ideal, obviously. I would like to, you know, see more of Kante on the ball with that crazy dribbling. But it's okay. We, we've still got another game, lads. We've still got another game. He's, he's going to absolutely destroy his next opponent. You'll see. Another thing I do want to check, lads. I do want to have a look at the work of the other Kante. Yeah, it's me. I thought that might be the case. So the other one is medium high, whereas this one is high high. And that's pretty interesting, lads, because obviously as a box to box, you're definitely gonna wanna go, like you wanna get this Kante if you want him as a as an out and out centre mid like what I've got. Whereas if you're looking for a CDM with more defending and stuff, you definitely go with the other Kante. So yeah, we're just to another game, okay? Hopefully Kante can end with an absolute bang, okay? Maybe we'll get himself like a cheeky goal, that'd be pretty cool. So yeah, let's jump into game number three. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, he's dumbing the fuck out of me here. Oh, he's not made me. What the fuck? That's it, Kante. It's the dribbles we love to see. Oh, good play. Lewandowski! Great finish and great play there, lads. All started from Kante. No fucking way. Oh, my God. Kante, he'll have a drive at this defence, I think. Yep. Finesse it. Oh, Kante! What a strike, lad. And again, it's that dribbling. You just get it with him in the midfield and he just drives at the defence so effortlessly. This shit is the best shit ever. Ah, oh, shit. Come on, Cooley. No, Coo Cooley. Cooley. Oh, I thought they went in. That is taking the absolute... I'm sorry. Timo Werner can't score from three yards out in real life, let alone that. What the fuck? For fuck's sake, I tried to follow the run, but I couldn't. Di Lorenzo was too fucking slow. He should have shot that. He would have scored if he just shot that. No. Oh, fucking... That's so open over there. I'm actually salty. Like, I'm genuinely upset. Nice. Nefed. Come on, Nefed. That is not a pen. That is not. I'll take it. Oh, I'll fucking take it, but that's not a pen. Yes, Ron, come on! Ah! Maybe we can get a winner. We've got 20 seconds to go. It's gonna have to be a snappy one. Nah, that's all she wrote, boys. I do not. I'll take it. Yeah, I did not deserve that penalty whatsoever. So I'll, I'll, I'll take that. So yeah, guys. I, this is a really difficult one for me, okay? Because this card was so good. I really, really enjoyed this card. So it's really hard for me to say that he's not worth that money. However, 300k. That's a lot of money, lads. And there are a lot of options out there, especially for a lot cheaper. If you do absolutely have to have Kante in your team, okay, you just love Kante, it may be IRL or in FIFA, this is a good option, okay? He's really good in-game. Especially if you need a box-to-box -box version of Kante, okay? Obviously, the, the normal card Kante is a lot more better defensively and has those medium-high work rates. This version has a lot more pace, okay? So he's much better at driving at defences and stuff like that, as you guys would have seen throughout the epi. Plus, those high-high work rates are definitely better for a box-to-box. -box. But anyway, boys, I'm going to call it there. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, subscribe and I'll see you guys next one all right peace